Hey guys, welcome back to Vet Science. We are hardworking people here. We don't like to be lazy. And even if we do like to be lazy, we just simply can't afford it. It's just the road we chose. You probably had some days where you felt like trash, or you probably feel like trash every single day. And I'm here to tell you that it's completely fine. I understand you. Sometimes we work long hours, we don't get enough sleep, and we have to study all the time. All of this can put a lot of stress on you. Two things can happen here. You either get used to feeling like trash all the time, and you just simply don't give an F anymore, or you can do something about it. So today I'm gonna tell you how to survive a long day at work and how to still have energy after work. Let's get started. Tip number one, get up early. If you haven't tried getting up early and you usually wake up 20 minutes before you have to leave the house to go to work, then this probably is not gonna be very easy for you. But getting up early will give you enough time to properly wake up before you have to go anywhere. And if you wake up early, you don't have to rush and worry that you're gonna be late for work. I personally wake up at 5 a.m. Sometimes I do sleep until 6, but this gives me at least two to three hours before work that I can do whatever I want and I can do so much before I even have to go to work. Number two, eat three meals a day plus snacks. It's very important to have a good meal in the morning because that food you eat in the morning will give you energy until lunch. Then when you have another meal at lunchtime, you're gonna have energy for the rest of the day. For me, it's very important not to miss those two meals because when I get home after work and I haven't had a breakfast or a proper lunch, I guarantee you I will have zero energy. And dinner, if you miss dinner, you're gonna go to bed hungry. And you know what's gonna happen? You're not gonna get a good night's sleep. And in the next morning, you're gonna feel worse than trash. I don't know what food is good for you. you gotta find that out on your own. You gotta do your research and see what food works for you. Tip number three, coffee after food and drink as much water as you can. Try drinking coffee after you ate something. There was a time where I didn't have any breakfast where the first thing I would put in my mouth is coffee. The only thing that happened is that I was starving and my blood pressure spiked and I was feeling horrible. So now I drink coffee half an hour after I've eaten breakfast. The problem I had with water is that I forget to drink water, I just don't feel thirsty. So I downloaded this app, I'm gonna leave the information down below in the description box. So this app reminds me to drink water so I don't forget. Number four, workout. I love working out. I usually work out four or five days and one day I rest. If I don't work out for a long time, my body feels horrible, like I need this. I don't like working out in the morning, I like my mornings to be calm, to relax. So I work out after work, I get home, change my clothes and I immediately start working out. I work out at home so I don't have to go to a gym to do that. I work out for an hour, hour and a half. I do that because after work I feel drained, I feel tired and this is the thing that wakes me up, gives me energy and charges me for the next four hours before I have to go to bed. And of course I do it because it makes me happy. Number five, do at least one thing every day that calms you. In the morning try doing things that will relax you and calm you. When I get up in the morning, I usually meditate or write in my journal or both and make a to-do list. You can do whatever you want. You can read, you can paint, just find something and find time to do something that will relax you, will relax your body and mind. It doesn't have to be in the morning, it could be in the afternoon after work. Doing all of this helps me to be more energetic and productive at work and the best thing is that after work, when I get home, I have more energy. So I can do all the things I want and not feel like trash. 
I wasn't always like this. This is a choice I made. And if I can tell my 15 year old self that in the beginning of my 20s, I will start waking up at 5 a.m., I would have laughed so hard in my face. I hope these tips were helpful. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe to my channel and follow me on social media. Also, don't forget to click the notification button so you get notified every time I post a new video. If you like this video and if you want to see more videos like this, don't forget to comment down below or just tell me what you want to see. Keep giving that amazing care to your animals and I will see you next time. Bye!